Well, tomorrow night we are proud to present Protecting Our Children. It's a team effort by the broadcasters of Central New York with new perspective on stopping child abuse. Part of the presentation explores the stories of adult survivors of abuse, including a man named Dan Leonard, who lived with the shame of what a football coach did to him for years. Matt Mulcahy reports. He's a lot smarter than you are. He's done this before. He's got a routine. Um, the first day it happened, um, we were washing and waxing his car. Uh, he gave me two or three beers. His abusers started talking about sex. Leonard remembers being uncomfortable, but at 11 years old, he didn't know what to do. Then he made me take a shower. He said that he wouldn't, you know, that I was sweaty from the work and that he wouldn't take me home like that. So that's how he pushed me into that. Uh, then he got in the shower, then he gave me a massage, then it happened, you know, I mean, it, it, it went like that. From that moment on, Dan felt trapped by his secret. He risked further embarrassment and shame if he revealed it to anyone. Yet 25 years later, with his marriage and his family hanging in the balance, he saw a therapist who drew him out. She immediately told me uh, that I was only a child that I had no control of the situation. Um, a lot of things that sound pretty basic and pretty simple, but were very important for me to hear at that time. But I was, I was devastated. I was um, uh, just extremely upset and overwhelmed. That was Matt Mulcahy reporting. You're going to see all of that report, including how Dan Leonard turned his life around. We hope you will watch Protecting Our Children tomorrow night at 7 o'clock here on NBC3.